It all started when NAFTA contracted a certain supplier to provide taxi lamps that were meant to be delivered and installed on taxis from Vindus. But the newly formed Namibia Public Passenger Transport Association, NPPTA, is opposed to the idea, arguing that the lamp supplier should not operate from this place because of inadequate spaces of buses at the terminal. Yesterday, members of the NPPTA started blocking other operators to enter the loading terminal, a situation which caused chaos and anger, and the police was called in to calm the situation. But NPPTA remains adamant that NAPTA should not be operating from this place as they apparently do not have majority members and should find another place. We do not want these guys from NAPTA, these four that we hear from the taxi rent to decide for us. The owners of this taxi rent, we are going to take control of this taxi rent. And that is why we are saying, we, we, we want to fight for them. We want to fight for them. However, NAPTA has refused to be pushed from their place, claiming they are the authentic owners of the place as per agreement with Cartex, which owns the bus loading terminal. It is National Secretary Vispa Munda described the squabbles as total chaos caused by Carrera and Van Vick. They are trying to block the, the others, not to, to come to, uh, to law. This is why I'm saying most of the people were forced whether it's he to not or she does not want to register with uh, this association, the new association of Mr. Carora and George, he will be not allowed to, to operate from, from, from the ground here. This is the problem. With the assistance of the police, it was then agreed that business should continue as usual to wait for the two parties to meet tomorrow with Puma Management, which has taken over the service from Caltex.